Grab your computers and your voice recorder because we're about to dive into the world of streaming in The Sims 4. And this is in relation to the video game streamer career that comes with the High School Years expansion pack. To start out, you're going to want to join this career, which you can do by having your teenager or adult sim find a job from the business section of their phone. Note that when selecting the job, you'll also want to pick your preferred shift. You can choose to work either 5.30 to 7.30 a.m. or 9 to 11 p.m. Personally, I find the morning shift to be a little bit easier to squeeze in gameplay-wise, but choose whichever you like. I mean, we do love a two-hour shift. Once you've joined, then you'll be prompted to pick a SimTuber avatar. And do know that you can choose or change this at any time using the business section of your phone or the career section of a computer. This avatar will be the icon that appears when performing stream-related interactions. After becoming a video game streamer, then in the career section of your computer, you'll have some fancy new options. Most notably, you'll be able to live stream Crypt Creeper. You can live stream from any computer, not just the streaming themed computers that come with the high school years pack. And doing this will train your video gaming and your entrepreneur skill at the same time while also seeing you acquire a few side hustle followers as well. Also a quick side note is that having a sim who likes video games or who has the geek trait can be helpful for this style of gameplay as both of these can provide positive moodlets for your sims when streaming. And don't forget to give the lot where you stream from the fast internet lot trait which will make training the video gaming skill take 25% less time. Now being a streamer is not just about the video gaming skill. To progress in the career, you'll need to level up both the video gaming and the entrepreneur skill. You'll need level 2 of both for the first promotion, which will see you become a speedrunner. This promotion also unlocks the ability to stream Sims Infinite, which is classified as an unreleased game. As well as farming with friends, which as you might have guessed, you can actually stream with another Sim, and doing so will provide a small relationship boost. You'll also have your pay bumped to 43 simoleons an hour, and you'll get a 400 simoleon bonus, which is like, yay, we do love a bonus. To reach level 3, which is the top of the career, you'll need to reach level 4 of both the video gaming and the entrepreneur skill. Reaching the top of the career will see your pay bumped to 61 simoleons an hour, provide a 750 simoleon bonus, and will also unlock the golden ultra-wide pro computer to purchase, which does look rather neat. You'll also unlock a new interaction on the career section of the computer called Read Sims Chat. Doing this takes about an hour and will see your sim earn a few simoleons that come through in rapid small amounts. Generally, you can expect to make around 25 to 50 simoleons from this interaction. It's a great way to generate money with the career beyond your work hours and it can feel much more natural, so I'm a big fan. Now the daily task in the career is to do a live stream, and I should note that you can start a live stream and then stop it two seconds later to tick this off. That's right, you don't actually have to complete the live stream. Stopping a live stream seconds after you start will also see your sim gain side hustle followers, However, video gaming and entrepreneur skill gain is dependent on the amount of time you spend live streaming. So you'll need to actually spend time live streaming to level these up. Now I found the best way to progress in the career was to make sure you complete the daily task each day and then actually go into work, making sure that your sim is on time and in a good mood. Once your sim starts work, you'll also want to click on the little person picture on their head icon and change the way they work to be work hard, which will help boost work performance, though note that it might make your sim tense. While you can also work this career from home, I don't suggest this. Firstly, it's currently bugged and completing the one task you are required to do will only provide you with 10 simoleons rather than your full day's pay. Also, anecdotally, I found it much slower to progress in the career this way. However, if I haven't deterred you, then here are some of the work from home tasks that you can come across. You might have to talk to a friend about your side hustle, which is located in friendly interactions, and note that sims don't actually have to be your friend to tick this off. You might have to complete a live stream, 
And as a work from home task, this will only tick off if you finish the whole thing. You can't just start and cancel it like you can a daily task. You might also have to cross promote at a venue, which requires you to go to a community lot and then use the cross promote option from the business section of your phone. Another work from home task is to update your online bio with a headshot. For this, take a selfie and then click on the photo in your inventory and upload it. Once you're a speedrunner or the second rank in the career, you might also have to advertise your side hustle online, which is completed by advertising your video game stream from the career section of your computer or the business section of your phone. You might also have to stream an unreleased game in which streaming Sims Infinite will tick this off. You could also be asked to live stream with a friend and streaming farming with friends with another sim will complete this. Now earlier I mentioned the entrepreneur skill, and leveling this has uses beyond being promoted. At level 2, you'll be able to advertise your video game stream online, which will see you gain a few side hustle followers and a little bit of entrepreneur skill experience. At level 3, you can research a business plan. This will see a business plan object appear in your inventory, but you won't be able to do anything with it just yet. At level 4 of the entrepreneur skill, you can use a business plan to contact angel investors for funding. This will consume the plan, but you'll get a decent sized cash injection for it, which I found was usually between 250 and 2000 simoleons, with more money being given to better quality plans. While reaching level 5 of the entrepreneur skill isn't required for the career, doing so lets you appear on Llama's lair for the cost of a business plan but admittedly, this doesn't appear to do anything. You'll also gain the knowledge trait, which gives Sims a salary boost of around 25% when they're an adult and also makes it so Sims will give you more receptive responses when chatting to them. Note that you won't get the salary boost as a teenager. Finally, before finishing up, I just wanted to mention that there's a very similar way to play as a streamer that is base game friendly. As an adult, your sim can enter into the tech guru career and at level 7 in the career, then they can specialize in the esports gamer branch. As soon as you enter this branch, you'll be able to live stream, both from a computer and from a gaming console should you have the City Living expansion pack. This starts off earning very little, but will see you gain a moderate amount of fans. And the more fans you have, the more money you'll begin to make from live streaming. It's just a handy thing to know about for if you just have the base game. And also note I'll pop a link to a guide in the description showing more ways to play and make money as a gamer for if you're interested. And with that, we're at the end. That's a complete guide to the video game streamer career in The Sims 4. If you enjoyed or found this helpful, then please subscribe and leave a like. I would really appreciate it and have an amazing day. See you later.